today we're going to be doing a corn casserole. Uh, it's a great side dish with barbecue. You can do it on the barbecue, you can do it in your oven, doesn't really matter. Uh, we're going to be using the PK grill all day, so why not? Uh, we're going to start with sifting some plain flour. So we've got two thirds of a cup. A tablespoon of baking powder, also sifted. Uh, this is important as it gives a fluffier texture. So we're kind of going for a texture between a creamed corn and a um, cornbread. Almost like a pudding. Right, next we've got half a cup of polenta. I like to use the uh, finer grey polenta. You can get it in a few different textures. Also a third of a cup of white sugar. And a teaspoon of salt. I've right, got the dry ingredients here, we're just going to mix them around and we'll start adding the wet ingredients next. Ingredients are going to be two tablespoons of vegetable oil, a can of drained corn kernels, and a can of creamed corn. I've also got a cup of sour cream here as well. You can use light sour cream if you are if you're watching your weight, but let's face it, we're in barbecue. There's no watching weight. All right, next up we've got a couple of eggs. Uh, this is optional, um, but I find it helps it make the batter a bit more fluffy and uh, makes the texture a bit tidier. And we're just gonna mix this all through. Right, like any sort of baking, make sure you spray your pans so we don't want the sides to stick. Now we'll pour our batter in. As you can see, we've got a charcoal set up on one side, so we're going to set the uh, casserole on the other. We want to run it around 350 degrees Fahrenheit, the pit. If it's a little bit hotter, that's okay. Uh, it should only take about half an hour or so. We'll start probing it and see if it comes out clean. All right, this has been in for about 40 minutes, sitting at about 350 in the PK. Uh, as you can see, we've got some nice brown edges. Now you can probably keep this going a little bit and get the whole thing looking brown, but I really don't want to have burnt edges around the sides. So. Just to test like anything you bake, any sort of cake, just sort of hit the middle and see if the skewer comes out clean. And that is pretty clean. Um, if it came out wet, we'd say leave it for another five, but it's pretty good. Here's our corn casserole. <laughs> 